Numerous blockchain projects have appeared to assist the development of the blockchain as the concept of decentralization is gaining enormous popularity. In the blockchain community, media attention greatly helped Bitcoin and Ethereum. One blockchain initiative, although receiving little public attention, is making a significant contribution to making life easier for blockchain engineers. The Hyperledger project was started by the Linux Foundation in order to standardize blockchain for the corporate world because numerous blockchains are built from the ground up for various uses. Hyperledger combines cross-industry expertise to enable enterprises to create custom blockchain apps that cater to particular business demand, assisting businesses in solving their problems effectively. And that's what we'll be talking about today. Firstly, we'll see what is Hyperledger, after which we'll have an understanding of the Hyperledger with a bit of its history, after which we'll see the organizational structure and the technology layers. After which we'll see the need of Hyperledger along with its working. And then we'll talk about Hyperledger projects and lastly a simple conclusion. Now before we begin, please make sure to subscribe to our YouTube channel and hit that bell icon for regular updates from us. Now let's get started with our first agenda that is what is Hyperledger. Providing the essential foundation, rules, guidelines and tools to construct open source blockchains and related applications for usage across numerous industries. Hyperledger is a global business blockchain project. Projects from Hyperledger include a range of permission blockchain systems that are business ready, where network users are familiar with one another and have an inherent incentive in taking part in consensus making. A company can implement multiple modular blockchain solutions and services using the parts that are offered under the Hyperledger umbrella to dramatically increase the effectiveness of the operations and business processes. Now let's take a look at the key takeaways. Hyperledger is working to create a stable set of frameworks, tools and libraries for permissioned enterprise-grade blockchain deployments. It is an international partnership that the Linux Foundation is hosting and its member companies include some of the top names in supply chain, manufacturing, technology, finance, banking and the Internet of Things. There are several related initiatives such as Hyperledger Fabric, Sawtooth, Composer, and Cello. Now let's understand Hyperledger with a bit of history. The Linux Foundation, which has its headquarters in San Francisco, California, launched the Hyperledger project in December 2015. Today there are more than 120 member companies, up from its initial 30 member companies. In order to improve the efficiency, performance, and transactions of various business operations, Hyperledger was established with the goal of speeding up industry-wide collaboration for the development of high-performance and dependable blockchain and distributed ledger-based technology framework. Leading companies from the financial, banking, IoT, supply chain management, manufacturing and production, and technology sectors are part of the global collaboration known as Hyperledger. Along with a number of blockchain-based businesses like Blockforce and Consensus, they include household names like Bosch, IBM, Samsung, Microsoft, Hitachi, American Express, JP Morgan, and Visa. Let's take a look at the organizational structure. In essence, Hyperledger is neither a company nor a network of cryptocurrencies, nor a blockchain system. Although it does not support a cryptocurrency like Bitcoin, it functions by offering the required standards and infrastructure for the creation of a variety of blockchain-based systems and applications for use in the industrial sector. Consider Hyperledger to be a hub between numerous independent blockchain-based projects and tools that follow its specified design philosophies operate. The several initiatives comprise the following. We have Hyperledger Fabric, then we have Hyperledger Composer, Hyperledger Cello, Hyperledger Explorer, then we have Burrow, Sawtooth, and lastly, Caliper. All of these Hyperledger affiliated projects adhere to a design paradigm that promotes interoperability, a modular and extensible approach, and security features. The projects don't support any specific tokens or cryptocurrencies, though users can build them as needed. Let's take a look at the technology layers. The primary business elements used by Hyperledger in its architectures are as follows. Firstly, we have the consensus layer. 
This layer is in charge of establishing an understanding of the sequence and validating the accuracy of the collection of transactions that make up a block. Processing transactions requests and approving only legitimate transactions are the responsibilities of the smart contract layer. The transfer of messages between peers is handled by the communication layer. In order to maintain and validate users and systems identities and build trust in the blockchain, identity management services are a requirement. The blockchain can be interfaced by third-party programs and clients thanks to the API or application programming interface. Now let's see what is the need of Hyperledger. Through extensive testing, the developers involved discovered that blockchain networks where each peer must simultaneously execute consensus and validate each and every transaction suffer greatly in terms of scalability. Above that, due to the extensive steps necessary to maintain a transaction's integrity, transactions with a degree of privacy linked to them cannot be conducted on the public blockchain but is possible with Hyperledger. Let's take a look at the working of Hyperledger. It's quite different on a network powered by Hyperledger. Only the ledgers of the peers who are directly involved in the deal are connected and updated. Only with the aid of permissions and restrictions imposed on the network can third parties who assist with the transaction determine the precise quantity of information they require. Let's take a look at the Hyperledger projects. A wide range of corporate blockchain technologies such as smart contract engines, graphical user interfaces, distributed ledger frameworks, applications and libraries are promoted and incubated within the overarching strategy that Hyperledger adheres to. The Hyperledger fosters innovation in distributed ledger technology components and promotes the reuse of building blocks. Firstly, we'll talk about Hyperledger Burrow. One of the Hyperledger projects, Hyperledger Burrow, is hosted by the Linux Foundation and offers a modular blockchain client for creating a legal smart contract machine in accordance with the Ethereum Virtual Machine specification, that is EVM. Burrow's proof of stake consensus engine, among other things, allows for high transaction throughput and transaction finality. Next, we have Hyperledger Indy. Hyperledger Indy is a distributed ledger that offers libraries, reusable paths, and tools to build digital identities on the blockchain. It was specifically designed for decentralized identification. Next, we'll talk about Hyperledger Fabric. Hyperledger Fabric is a distributed ledger platform that offers resilience, scalability, adaptability, and confidentiality and is supported by a modular architecture. It can overcome complications that exist throughout the economic ecosystem because it is specifically built to give pluggable implementation of different components. Next, we have Hyperledger Iroha. One of the Hyperledger projects, Hyperledger Aroha, is hosted by the Linux Foundation and is used to create reliable, secure, and powerful blockchain applications. The platform can be used to handle serialized data, digital assets, and identities. It is helpful for applications like National ID, Interbank Settlement, and Central Bank Digital Currencies. Last project that we'll talk about is Hyperledger Sawtooth. A corporate blockchain platform called Hyperledger Sawtooth is used to create distributed ledger networks and applications. It is built in such a way as to maintain the distributed ledgers and guarantee the security of smart contracts. Let's take a look at the conclusion now. While most of the blockchain projects emphasize on tokens and cryptocurrencies, Hyperledger projects have the potential to develop the backbone of high-scaling industrial and non-monetary applications. Also, the Hyperledger projects are backed by renowned companies like IBM and Linux. That's it for this video. Thank you for watching. Just a quick info guys. IntelliPad provides blockchain certification training mentored by industry experts. The course link of which is given in the description below.